Oh, has he got that? It's been called in. He looked very close, and yeah, I think it has just caught the line. A couple of unbelievable return winners to start off this opening return game. Well, they just clicked almost immediately, these two, Grenois and Zabaios. so well there off of a fantastic return from Mektic, it was almost just out of reach. Well, they went with Mate Pavic and it was a good decision. Solid return and it is Mektic and Pavic who make the first move, 3-1. See Pavic so ready, sees the quality of Mektic, his inside out forehand going deep Easy into the way. right into that corner. And Pavic then just gets up on his toes, takes a little step forward. Oh, good stretch from Grenoyes. It's another super return from Nikola Mektic, landing just an inch or so inside the baseline. They have the double break, and they will now serve for this opening set. That's <laughs> cleverly done. And Nikola Mektic and Mate Pavic showing just why they are the best doubles team in the world right now. A flawless opening set, 22 minutes, they take it 6-1. And that's how they, they time it so well. I mean, all, all the doubles players do it. It's not particular to Mektic and Pavic, but it's as soon as they hear that contact from behind them, that's their cue to leap up and move. And, You've got to have such confidence in your partner that they're going to hit their spots, they're going to hit them well, <laughs> and they're setting you up. Very good defensive point from Mektic and Pavic. Super anticipation from Pavic at the net. You saw he pushed back first in case the lob came whilst Mektic continued to close. So they were just starting to split rather than a lot of the time you'll see both players just try and get on top of the net as much as they could. But thinking the lob might be there, he'd already taken a step and a half before it was struck. I was there with plenty of time. It's a lovely return. A one handed backhand in full flow from Horacio Ceballos. Yeah, it's really well controlled from Mate Pavic. Thought he was in a spot of bother there. Desperately trying to scamper backwards to hit that overhead. Probably the most pressure they've been in, actually, in a service game. Looks as though he's just hurt his right hand as well here, Mate Pavic. Yeah, it's a good call from Nikola Mektic. Just told Pavic to get out of the way, it was his. Well, to get that return, just dipping in front of Mate Pavic. Yeah, really smart to run around it, just gives that extra availability of that whip and dip. Oh, 
Yeah, it's good. Into the gap. And for the first time today, Grenoyers and Ceballos with a look at the deciding point. Yes, deciding point. The volley goes wide. And Grenoyers and Ceballos break in this second set as they look to try and turn round this final. Great response from these two after being blown off the court, really, in that opening set. Sharp at the net from Grenoyers. And just like their semi-final match in Monte Carlo a few weeks ago, this one will be settled by a match tie-break. A minute shy of the hour mark, super response from Grenoyers and Zabayel, 6-3. Well, Marcel Grenoyers looking to become the first Spaniard to win the men's doubles titles in the Madrid tournament history. Ceballos also looking to become the first Argentine to do so as well. Yes, good early move from Grenoyers. They are just growing in confidence here. Nektic and Pavic with plenty of work to do. Super return from Mektic. They are not done with by any stretch. Marcel Grenoyers and Horacio Zabayos are the 2021 Mutua Madrid Open doubles champions. It's their third Masters 1000 title together, and they win it by beating the winning machine that is Nikola Mektic and Marte Pavic. Remember, they hadn't lost a match tiebreaker all year. Well, they have now. And it is some response from these two after being blown away in that opening set. It looked as though this final was going to be over in no time at all. But Grenoyers and Ceballos very much had other ideas. So a great week for Marcel Grenoyers and Tarasio Ceballos, their third Masters 1000 title together. And their first ever tournament together was a Masters 1000 event. That was in Montreal back in 2019. They actually went on to win that. And then, of course, won in Rome at the back end of last year to try and defend their title next week.